So this is the MIUI version 14.0.23.3.7 developer beta update which is being rolled out and it is based on the alloy port. So if you're gonna try on your Redmi Note 10, you must try out this and without waiting a further ado, let's get started with the video. So if you can clearly see that in the, I'm on the my device section and in this port room you get a bunch of good options that you can see. First of all, you can see that there is the detailed specs of the device and it is being equipped with the latest smart security update over this device and and it is having the latest android 13 which i really want in this device and in the mui room or what do you say mui mint room we aren't getting so far android 13 so we are getting android 13 over there so there is not an issue i have just changed it its kernel first of all it has uh, somewhat like puff kernel in it but i have just changed it to west coast super fast kernel but if I, I will gonna tell you side by side which is best kernel for this uh, what do you say MIUI port room so first of all this is the MIUI 14 first of all the, all the look in the sim card and network setting I haven't faced any uh, what do you say issues you get a USM toolkit also over there and advanced settings over there extreme modes and everything that you want it is being present over there so now let me talk about and it is first of all Chinese Chinese what do you say ported rom so you will get some china written things chinese so don't be afraid of that things there's there's no issue with this also wi-fi haven't saw any sort of issues in the wallpaper and personalization you can see that oh, there's the only single look that you already present over there and i have also aod option but there is not much of the aod what do you say options is being available over there is there the icon pack option you can increase or decrease icon size over there according to you you all know that's about what i can say about these things now fonts is being there you can customize and it totally depends on the user to user always on display lock screen option there nothing more is new there and this is the display option over there you get the, all the non normal settings over there font settings and everything that is present over any of the rooms this is first of all sounds option you getting the sound effects also over there but there is no what do you say dolby atmos support over there i have testing out the what do you say alpha droid custom room over this redmi note 10 pro so you must check out this video i will gonna drink down this video in upcoming days now there is nothing new to talk about there is nothing in control centers over there and this is as usual things no, not a much more customizations even that MIUI Mint does provide customizations above on that part. This is the home screen one system navigations and gestures option is a gesture confirmation and so swipe up to home screen option is there and home screen these were the normal three settings now, what is the options that is been available right now in Indian rooms also. This is not a new thing. And this where that there is a two new things. If I just disable once, then you can see that it will it won't work. So you have to just you know, notification state in control center. You just need to enable out. Have voltage option. You can enable or disable according to your usage. Fingerprint and face unlock is available. I have checked out that we're working fine. I have now on the performance mode of the device itself and haven't saw any of the issues and most of the people will ask me about me why i'm not pulling out the videos regularly on the channel because of there is some reasons i'm not physically fit and having some issues and that's why i'm not giving, getting the videos delivered to you so if you are new to this channel and what is this sort of me why custom room content over there you must watch this video and subscribe it this is the system launcher options over there and this is a screen times option and normal things option not much new if you talk about in the advanced settings yes there is a few of the options that is being ported from the alloy as we know that there is a 4gb ram variant that i owns but it is being equipped with a 1gb of virtual ram but in this you get the memory extension up to 3gb because it is being ported to alloy now there is not much of the new things now let's talk about what the performance that is device is opting over the performance mode itself so first of all i took the in the, into the history scores and there is two times i have uh, taken this were taken in the midnight and this is the morning itself nothing more new you can check out these scores itself and not a much of new things that i can notice over this is the as usual scores custom room does provides more greater than scores 
and you whenever you boot this rom you going to find not find a play store you have to search the play store over the what do you say get apps option this is a study mark application i also took its benchmark over there and this is a my device results page you can see that sing shot extreme test overrun there and it performs damn great scores no issues that faced but not as custom roms that you can expect for this now I also took what do you say a uh, Qi battery and the battery charging is damn good the battery charge around 45 minutes take our 45 minutes to charge but not as custom rooms fast and if you talk about me CPU throttling test what the results about the CPU throttling test this was a supposed to be 79% max performance results that I got which is ran for 15 minutes and as you can see that this is what I already talked about Yeah the main highlight over there is that safety status does not pass so it has the issue of that also now uh, most of the people ask me about the DRM info yes we are getting security L1 but you just need to take care of that safety net does not pass so you don't if you have lots of money in your bank account don't going to use this app icon animation does not work but if you click what do you say widget that i can box with the animation this is the pre rooted room i have just got to change the what do you say kernel if i click on the device certification as you can see that device does not certifies by the way i can show you about the device is not certifies so this is all about the what do you say miui mint not miui alloy port and you get the normal camera as usual you can see over there there is no not a single issues that i going to find in this rom but if you have lots of money don't use this a miui port roms so if you really going to satisfy this from this video hit the subscribe button and like the video for more content future related so till then